Yeah, how about the, the stars will heal. It still works fine. I can get the eyelid open. The fear has passed. The whole side of his face was open and there was blood all over him. And but the story of bravery, of survival, that Pike Carlson lives to tell will surely never fade. I just remember walking up and then seeing a mountain lion. It's been just two weeks since the eight-year-old was playing in his backyard with his older brother Gage when he went to talk to a neighbor down the hill. Gage runs through the back door and said, Pike's yelling for help. I was hoping that Gage heard it or someone would hear my screaming. Armed with a knife and a father's determination to save his child, Ron Carlson raced outside and found a sight no parent should ever see. His head was inside the lion's mouth and I watched and I think that that's what made me snap inside is watching, watching him chew on him. The mountain lion had pinned Pike under a tree. Pike was fighting back. I was just punching, trying to grab anything that I can, like a stick, and I did find a stick and I tried to get it in the eye, but soon the stick snapped. He's already had two surgeries, but may need another. He's already had dozens of stitches and staples, but those wounds will heal. I look at him and go, he's going to be okay. It's going to be all right. At eight years old, he's already been through a lot. <laughs> but nothing is more important than Pike Carlson still being here today to share his story. It actually didn't hurt. In Bailey, I'm Mark Salinger, 9 News. Yeah. And you saw, you, you know, the mountain lion.